much goes out to Jessica and Lindsay. I know Lindsay since December 2019. 18? No, December 2018. 2018. And then I've known Jessica since August. No, July. Huh? No, July. August of 2019. I've known you a long time, so I can say this. And you don't have to feel the same way. You know, nobody ever does because you're too ugly to be loved. Too ugly to be loved in that way. But sometimes unrequited love is sometimes sweet. See, they're playing a commercial, and I'm not doing a freaking advertisement here. Sometimes unrequited love is the most sweet. Even though you know you're never going to be loved back. It's okay because at least you feel something in your heart. You know what I mean? Besides dread and hell. Shoot me in the head, hit me with a chainsaw, I live in hell. I live in hell. But it's nice to feel something besides, you know, dread and hell. It's nice to feel love, and you know, it's not going to be reciprocated because it's too ugly to be loved. But I do love you. You're too ugly to be loved, and I'm too ugly to be kissed. So I have to skip this ad because it's two minutes and 28 seconds. I just need someone in my life to give it structure To handle all the selfish ways I spend my time without her You're everything I want but I can't deal with all your lovers You're saying I'm the one but your actions I speak louder Giving me love when you are down and need another. I've got to get away and let you go. We've got to get over. But I love you so. I love you so. I love you so. I love you so I'm gonna pack my things and leave you behind the feelings old I know that I made up my mind I hope you feel what I felt when you shattered my soul cause you were cruel and I fool you're not cruel so please let me go but I love you so I love you so I love you so I love you so Things that hurt me the most I know what, it, it kind of hurt me a little bit, you know, just a little bit. But when the second one post, post on Facebook in a relationship, when they both do, it's going to break my heart. I know I'm too much of a dick to be in a relationship. I learned that. I've been in one relationship after another since 1994. I mean, it's a three or four year break. Thank you very much.